Hawkeye chaps, um, I'm going absolutely mental with the videos tonight. I just got a comment um, asking me or, or saying that with the combination lock, you couldn't have two numbers in a row. Um, so I'm just going to show you how you can do that. Um, so it's going to be a quick video. But um, yeah, in its previous state, if you were to have two numbers in a row, they would activate at the same time, uh, which is not what you want. And there's a very easy way uh, to get around that. Um, so all it is is timings and all you've got to do is come to the latch that is the first of the two digits that are the same and you just need to extend this repeater to full and they need to come round on top of the AND gate in between or NAND gate um, and extend that as well so if that wasn't extended and I tried it like this both of them would light up as you can see from one button press we've lit up two torches but not what we want so we have to have full delay there and full delay there and that's the same that goes anywhere in the system you need to do that uh, if you're gonna have two numbers in a row so I'll reset it so now press it once first one lights up twice second one lights up so uh, that's just a heads up for you guys and if you are having trouble when you extend it for more digits so say if you had a six digit code out here um, and for some reason it's not working it's normally these delay lines here they might need an extra tick of delay uh, normally you can run them on one tick I believe um, but I think if you run them on two that helps you extend it uh, and just a bit more consistent if you've got more digits so uh, yeah that's just a heads up for you guys cheers